We're demonstrating the juice extraction capabilities of the Dash 2-speed juice extractor. Hey, here's a bit of behind the scenes insider intel for you. Sometimes when we need a sample for testing, we'll just order it from Amazon, which is what we did in this case. And check it out. It would seem we got someone else's return that they didn't clean, which is kind of gross. What? Our Dash juicers that we're selling are new, so this won't happen to you. Anyway, juicers are great for transforming food you have to eat into food you get to drink. Here's a whole big fruit party platter like from the grocery store, and sure, we'd all love to start our day by eating the whole thing, but who has time for all that biting and chewing in today's hectic workaday world? Well, watch as the Dash 2-speed juice extractor helps you bypass the teeth, over the gums, look out stomach, here comes like $8 worth of fruit in one tall refreshing glass. But it's Halloween you're saying. Can't the Dash 2-speed juice extractor extract juice from something more seasonal, like these little pumpkins with faces painted on them, or as they're apparently called, pals no hair? Three questions. What? Why are they called that? Why didn't they let an English speaker name them? Who knows, but to the original question of whether or not we can juice them, no, we can't really. Turns out a pal no hair, like Country Time Lemonade, contains no juice. Okay, but what about some good old Halloween candy, like these Jolly Rancher Bites, which, at least from the picture on the bag, look like they've got a liquid center, like little candy blisters? Well, we gave it a try, so you don't have to. And we do not recommend putting these in your Dash 2-speed juice extractor. They made a mess. Here's the inside of the pulp container after we juiced all this stuff. Mmm, pulpy. And that's the Dash 2-speed juice extractor. It's not for Jolly Rancher Bites.